YouTube. Today I did something new and exciting. Michael dressed himself today and I always get really proud when he dresses himself because he always picks out the collared shirts with the vests and I have no influence over what he wears. Really it was just vlogging in the car for the first time and I left the house. I mean that's that's not too exciting. I thought it would be cool to vlog in the car because this is what I do on a a weekly basis. See, I almost said daily there, but that's not true. Not even a little bit true. I went to the grocery store because we didn't have any food since Michael didn't go grocery shopping while I was gone, and we ate our final egg last night, and we literally had like a half a gallon of milk in the fridge, and then that's about it. And I don't even drink milk, so there was zero food in the house. So I packed up little Michael and we went to Kroger and you know everybody is bitching a fit because Kroger is no longer doubling coupons. Really? Who gives a shit? I don't. You know I, I know there are people out there that are just gonna be like well you are a cocksucker. Don't say stuff like that because I did because I needed 50 mustards in order for my family to survive. Yes. There are people out there like that. I was once one of those people. Once I realized how ridiculous it was, you know, we would get mad over things like another crazy couponer coming in before us and wiping off the shelf so we could only purchase four free mustards instead of 12. I mean, four is just not enough for a family of three. And I know a lot of people ask about how expensive is it to eat real food all the time and organic, paleo, gluten free, like I can't afford this and the answer is yes, yes you can, it just, it's a lot more work. I went today and saved $57 which is 28% of my bill and I also earned 350 fuel points which is 30 cents off a gallon and when you live in a household like ours where one of us drives a diesel and one of us drives a car that takes premium gas. No, 30 cents is a really, really big deal. And that 28% isn't even including the rebates. I have these these phone apps. Um, what the hell do I have? Check out 51, shop minimum, or something like that. Um, Ibotta, right, right. Saving Star, yes. And since I dropped out of the coupon game, I haven't really been checking them, but I checked them today and they now have offers for Halo oranges, and we buy those weekly, and onions, and milk. Really? I have never even heard of a coupon for, no wait, there was that one coupon um, mustache campaign. That was the one and only time I've ever seen something for, for milk. Programs are listening, which, which is really cool because I thought it was all for Gushers, which don't get me wrong, dude, I will get down on some Gushers but I try to save my treat for my pizza because I am a bad girl and I eat pizza every week. Now you guys are probably wondering, where is Michael in this entire daily vlog? Why are you just sitting down and talking to the screen and why did you have a conversation in the vehicle with the camera? I asked Michael a couple days ago to sit down and give me his boundaries for daily vlogging and what will he talk about, what won't he talk about. He does have to answer to a boss and I don't, I just have to answer to you guys. And those are two entirely different worlds. And I am trying to be respectful. All that means is he will poke his head in on the weekends or something when we do something a little more interesting than just Go grocery shopping. Woo! This weekend I am going to a bridal shower on Saturday and then I am going to Comic Con on Sunday with my sister. And she seems pretty cool. You'll probably like her a lot actually. You'll probably like her more than you like me. Hutch. It's okay. Whatever. It's cool. Oh hey, before I go, I did something big today, something new, something that wasn't daily vlogging. I pumped gas for the very first time in my vehicle. I really wish you guys would have been there with me because first of all, I had no idea which side I put gas in on. And I guess there's a little arrow on your gas thing that tells you which side, so that's cool, I learned that. 
And then, um, it's not just one of those flip open things, it's, it, there's an actual button inside my Jeep on the left hand side that pops it open. And there are no longer twist knobs on top before you, you put the, the nozzle in. Um, you just stick it in the hole. That's what she said. And it has a green diesel ring around the, um, the hole. That's not what she said. So I'll see you guys hopefully tomorrow. But if not, MS Monday will be here on Monday. See you guys later. Bye!